there is no mistake. But they take me. So it is finished. Can I? Finish? <laughs> there was one governor, Mr. Carmichael. So in India, in British period, every officer uh, had to learn the local language. We are students in the Scottish Church's College, or all professors who are Europeans. But during their service, they had to learn Bengali. Uh, so one governor, Mr. Carmichael, he was called for presiding over a meeting. Say he wanted to speak in Bengali. So he said, Dekite, dekite, tin basso katiya gel. So the transition is gallo. But he said gel. So people were smiling. <laughs> the audience, they were smiling. So there was some technique, just like we pronounce something and not um, to the <coughs> Correct, current pronunciation. So, but when we are reading Bengali, uh, let us do it as far as possible as the Bengalis do. That's all. Otherwise, it comes. Finished? No. Hmm. Hey, Ami. Hey, Ami. So, uh, jāpe jāre tāpotrāya. Te āmi kāne āmāya jāre tāpotrāya. Yaha nāhi jāni kāmane hi thā. Te āmi, who am I? Now, suppose I am sitting here, you are all sitting here. Uh, some fly comes and disturbs. We have got daily experience, uh, and he will disturb. I want to get him out, and he comes again, and stops on his mouth and clears some mistake. The fly, a small fly, not very big man. So, but after all, this is disturbance. I don't like it, but the fly will come and disturb. So there is no question that why this fly is coming and giving me disturbance and I do not want it. This is same man's inquiry. But there is no inquiry. I do not want there are three kinds of japi tapotra, three kinds of miserable conditions. One is called Adhyatik, another is called Adhi Daivik, another is called Adhi Bhut. Adhyatik means pertaining to the body and mind. All of a sudden, my mind is not in order. Uh, suppose a friend has come to talk with me. So I refuse to talk. I am not in mood. 
We have got this experience. I cannot stop it. Mind is not in order. This is happening daily, every moment. This is called adhyatmic. I did not want it, but it has come. All of a sudden I am feeling some headache. I did not want it, but it came. This is our practical experience. So this kind of trouble, I don't want. There are always either adhyatmic, adi adi that is your suffering. In this material world means the suffering going on. We are thinking we are very safe, running in the car. At any moment there may be accident. At any moment. I do not want it. My life may go. So this is same man's life. There are so many things. I do not want them, but they are enforced upon me, and I do not know how to get out. The fly is coming, disturbing. I can simply make some spray to kill it, as you do generally. But that killing is another risk. Uh, but those who do not know, they kill it, because they have no right to kill. Uh, suppose a man uh, is disturbing. So if you kill, you become a martyr, and you will be taken to the court, and you will be punished, and if you say, this man was disturbing me, therefore I have killed him. And that is no excuse. We have killed this man, he must suffer. This is ordinarily we find in our general uh, living condition. So, in the state of the Supreme Law, you cannot kill in a mosquito or in a fly. Kill the body. Because God says that everyone is my child. There is the same example. Suppose I have got so many brothers. One brother is a fool. So he creates me some disturbance. I kill him. So will the father will be happy? If you say, Father, yeah, your this child was disturbing me, I have killed. The father will be sorry. Why you have killed? This is natural. Uh, because one child of the father is a fool, the other intelligent child cannot kill him. Then the father will be angry or sorry. We do not know. We are doing irresponsibly. Therefore, Sanatana Goswami has gone to his spiritual master. He is asking this. This is also common, also very grave question. That in this material world, I do not want so many things, but they are enforced upon Why? This is human life. To inquire what? Not to the the modern theory is struggle for existence. There are troubles and you try to save yourself. And survival of the fetus. But nobody is fit. Nobody survives. Nobody wants death. But we are talking of survival. Who can escape death? There is no person. So there are so many slogans, but actually there is no remedy. There is remedy, but we do not know. That is the defect of modern life. There is remedy. Otherwise, we are, why you are talking this half? Why is Sanatana Goswami? is putting this question just to get the solution from the spiritual mind. Otherwise there is no need of putting this question that uh, what is my position? Why these threefold miseries always give me trouble? Why I die? 
and why I become old, why I become diseased, uh, why I have to take birth. Uh, they are simply struggling for existence that here is a child, uh, the child bearing is very troublesome, and if I give birth to a child, the mother is killed. This is going. But that means she is implicating herself. Again, in another way of life, this is going on. So this question, at the present moment, nobody asks this question, but this is very intelligent question. We are completely under the laws of nature. Prakita kyamanani gunai karmani sarvasa ahankara vimurātmā kartā. We are not independent. It's like in the state, in your country, although you have observed the independence ceremony, but you are not independent. If you go Keep to the right, if you go to the left, immediately your independence finished. So this so-called independence is conditional. It is not absolute independence. But if you want absolute independence, then you have to go back home, back to home. This is the problem. We are hankering after independence. But so long we remain in this material world, there is no question of independence. The intelligent man, when he inquires about, when he thinks over that I want independence from so many things, but I am not independent, I am forced to accept that what is my independence. When this question arises, then he is human being. Otherwise he is as good as the cats and dogs. Because the cats and dogs, they cannot inquire. Just like an animal is being sent to the slaughterhouse, he cannot say, why I am, what I have done, why you are sending me. He cannot protest. Even he protests, nobody hears. Nobody He protests. Uh, by crying, by screaming. Uh, but we have made our own theories. This crying is nothing. It has no soul we can kill. So in this way the whole world is going on under a gross atmosphere of ignorance. Uh, there, is, there are so many things to be discussed. Uh, just like we do not know what is the problem of life. How life comes uh, into existence. You see, a child is born, but you do not know where from the life came. The lump of matter of the child is not the child. If the child takes birth, death, without life, it has no value. It is a lump of matter, you throw it immediately. But if it has a life, then we take care of it. We raise it. The life is so important, uh, but nobody cares to know what is this life, where it begins, where from it comes, what is the destiny. No question. Similarly, if we, we are seeing every night so many planets, uh, we are making teeny attempts to go to a moon planet or some other planet. But there we see there are so many millions and trillions of planets. What about their situation? We have made our calculation from here that they are simply decoration. There is no life. No, there is life. There is life. But we do not know it. Uh, so uh, yesterday our scientist, Sarupta Dr. Samudara, was speaking that in the history, of human society. Actually, these two things are ignored. What is the beginning of life and what are these values? So we are 
after knowledge, but so many things are unknown to us. Therefore, Sanatana Goswami is teaching us by his practical behavior to approach the spiritual master and putting his case that I am suffering in this way. He was minister, there is no question of suffering. He was very well situated. That he has already explained that Grammabhavahare Kahaya Pondi Sotya Kurimani. There are so many questions I cannot answer. There is no solution. Still people say that I am very learned man. I accept foolishly. <coughs> Nobody is learned man unless he goes to the Guru. Tatvikyanatham sa Guru Meva Abhivatse Therefore Vedic injunction is that if you want to be learned, then go to one of my Guru, not the so-called Guru. Tatvidhi panipati na preprasne na srivaya upadakshanti tatvyanam jnana patru. Guru means one who has seen the absolute energy. Tattva darshina. Tattva means the absolute truth. And darshina one has seen. Now this moment, or this consciousness moment, is for this purpose, to see the absolute truth, to understand the absolute truth, to know the problems of life and how to make a solution. These things are our subject matter. Our subject matter is not material things. Somehow or other, you get a car and a good apartment and a good wife, then all your problems are solved. No. That is not solution of problem. The real problem is how to stop your death. That is your but because it is very difficult subject matter, nobody touches it. Uh, peacefully die, but nobody peacefully dies. Uh, if I take a dagger and I say, now die peacefully. <laughs> the whole peaceful condition finished immediately. He'll cry. Uh, but these are nonsense. If somebody says, I'll die peacefully, nobody dies peacefully. Uh, that is not possible. Therefore, death is a problem. Birth is also a problem. Uh, nobody is peaceful while within the womb of the mother. It is packed up, airtight condition. And then nowadays there is risk of being killed. So there is no question of this. Birth and death. And then old age, just like I'm old man, of so many troubles I have got. So old age and disease, everyone has not experienced. Even headache is sufficient to deal with trouble. So the real problem is this. But then old age and disease. That is the statement given by Krishna that Janma Vatu Jarabhadi Dukkhudu Sanu Dharma. If you are intelligent, you should take up these whole problems of life as very dangerous. So they, they have no knowledge, therefore they avoid this question. But we take up this question. That is the difference between other moment and Krishna consciousness. Our moment is how to solve this problem. The Shastra says that if you cannot solve this problem for your children, that is real contraceptive method. If you cannot protect your child from the imminent death or limitation of birth, then don't become a father. Don't become a father. This is how we actually father and father. If you should give him such education and knowledge that this is the last part. Next, we will not have any such body subjected to birth and death. That is what uh, that is what we are saying. 
तत्ता देहम पुनर्जन्म नहीं थी माँ में भी सिंपली ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड होल प्रॉब्लम बट इज द प्रॉब्लम सॉल्व द तत्ता देहम दिस बॉडी वी हैव टू गिव अपज इज मेटीरियल बॉडी वी मस्ट है बट दो कृष्ण कॉन्सेस आफ्टर गिविंग अर बॉडी लवर तत्ता देहम पुनर्जन्म नहीं थी पुनर्जन्म विद नेक्स्ट बार इफ यू एक्सेप्ट a material body then there is question of next body but if you remain in your spiritual body there is no question that is spiritual salvation or liberation if you remain in your spiritual body then you go back to home back to godhead krishna is complete spiritual body a the kingdom of god is also spiritual And you go there, you live there, you turn and that that the just the tiana ni mordan te the dhamam paramamam when when we do not come back again to this material world, that is the supreme abode of the supreme personality. So this um, benediction is offered by Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Well, very kindly come here. The guy go. So he take advantage of his mercy. Uh, he is very fortunate that the guy go is here. Uh, if you simply chant the guy go and dance, then you there is no division. There is no division. Then you are chanting Jai Shri Krishna. This simple chanting Jai Shri. हरे कृष्ण चांटिंग जग संकर्तन प्राय जजंती ही सुने दिस इज नॉट आई एम मैनुफैक्चर इन दिस एज सिंपली बाई चांटिंग एंड डांसिंग जग संकर्तन यू गेट कम प्लीज स्पिरिचुअल आई एम वेरी ग्लैड यू आर टेकिंग केयर ऑफ दी आई गो सो नाइसली सो नाइसली ग्रेस To continue these activities, and if uh, we cannot do anything, simply chant Hare Krishna and dance and jai Sachidananda, then that will make your life perfect. Thank you. Ah!